All right, ladies and gentlemen, for today's video, I'll be showing you all how you can easily finish the Seen Yoke event in Call of Duty Warzone Mobile. Yes, there is a bug with this event. I believe it's caused by these Arsenal coins, which you can honestly just get through daily challenges. I think it glitched out the game because there's nothing in the event store. Then the Arsenal store already have every single item. So yeah, I'm guessing that's what probably is the issue. If not, then damn, they really messed up their game. And on top of that, the event points are completely completely off basically after each match it's gonna give you a super inflated event points earn total but that's not true just pay attention to the top right hand corner of your screen and just keep track of that number per match yes you have to do the tracking yourself for this event because everything about it is just broken but as you can see here i was able to get every single reward besides the arsenal coins because those are bugged i know everything has a locked symbol on it but as long as you get this already owned pop up on the item you'll be good to go as you can see here i have the emblem and the calling card and i also have the shotgun and the combat knife blueprints so yeah i'm just gonna quickly go over these rewards although you can't unlock them all I'm still just going to cover them just in case they do fix the game. But there is still plenty of time to finish this event. So level one, you have to earn 300 event points to get the Koi Nobri Dream animated calling card. For level two, you have to earn 1,000 event points to get five arsenal coins. And I believe there is a total of 20 arsenal coins they can actually get from this event. For level three, you have to earn 10,000 event points to get the animated Hopeful Tides emblem. For the fourth level you have to earn 40,000 event points to get five more arsenal coins for level five you have to earn 70,000 event points to get the grumpy growler weapon sticker for level six you have to earn 100,000 event points to get five more arsenal coins for level seven you have to earn 130,000 event points to get yourself the stealth blossom blueprint for the combat knife for the eighth level you have to earn 165,000 event points to get yourself five more arsenal coins and lastly you have to earn 200,000 event points to get yourself the shogun's harmony blueprint for the lockwood 300 shotgun now in terms of how to get event points so for the first action if you deposit two hundred fifty thousand dollars with the cash balloon you can get yourself 100 event points for the second action you have to deposit five hundred thousand dollars at the helipad to get 250 event points opening any supply box gets you 50 event points and those top three actions are the only ones you can get a tactical boost for of course for the tactical boost as always we have a total of 30 that you can collect and you can only get these through opening supply boxes when you complete any contract during the mini contractor event and plunder you'll have this pop up on screen when that happens during that little time period any contract that you complete you can get yourself 1500 event points when you get the blood money pop up and plunder Hope you run to an enemy, down them, eliminate them. Then every $50,000 that they have in their loot will grant you 200 event points. Whenever you use a kill streak, and I'm just going to assume this applies to multiplayer and battle royale, you get 300 event points per kill streak. And lastly, every elimination that you get in a multiplayer match will grant you 50 event points. If you were to solely play multiplayer for this event, you have to get a grand total of 4,000 kills. So good luck with that if you're going to take that route. All right, now in terms of a guide. So obviously we have to play plunder and the only plunder game mode that we have currently is golden plunder. Then from there, you're actually gonna follow a very simple strat. All you're going to do is land in an area that has a buy station and collect all the cash nearby, run straight to it and spam buy UAVs. Soon as you have insufficient funds, just start spamming those UAVs. You get 300 event points per use. And honestly, I like that route a lot more than just depositing cash and cash balloons or even at the helipad i feel like you don't get enough event points for those two actions but the nice thing is you do get event points for opening supply boxes and we're going to be doing that a ton then when you get the contractor pop-up and plunder the next thing you're going to do is complete contracts personally i love getting the bounty contracts out the way i feel like those are a lot easier they're marked on the map than just try to win the gunfight and luckily since it's plunder you have unlimited respawn so you can keep challenging that person until you down them and that's it that's all you have to do to get this event done as fast as possible if you do get the blood money pop up then go hunt down other players but make sure to loot their bodies so you can get those event points it took me a grand total of 18 matches to get this event done so it might take you more games or even less games hopefully today's video was helpful make sure to drop a like subscribe if you're new turn on those post notifications 
all that good stuff and i'll catch you all in the next video and good luck to those that still need to finish the seeing yoke event in call of duty warzone mobile